The Brainerd baseball team opened the Class 3A state tournament bright and early this morning at 10 a.m. Shane Lee followed the Warriors to St. Paul as they looked to upset top-seeded Lakeville North in the quarterfinals. Just 15 minutes before the opening pitch at Midway Stadium, I checked in with the Brainerd faithful for their thoughts on the game. It's a real positive experience for all of us, the players, the fans. I think we can pull through and win this game. Unfortunately, the Warriors fall behind early. Lakeville North leads 3-0 in the third inning until Joseph Hader drills a line drive just out of reach for Bo Janicek. Hader stands up for the RBI triple. The next batter, Kyle Rodas, adds to the damage with a Texas leaguer into shallow right. He drives in another the run, Panthers go up 5-0. The Brainerd offense had no chance for a comeback against Mr. Baseball finalist Dalton Lennon. The 6'2 lefty racked up 12 strikeouts while allowing only two base hits and two walks in five innings pitched. Top-seeded Lakeville North defeats unseeded Brainerd 10-0 in six innings. I was able to locate fastball low and inside, high and outside. I was able to throw it wherever I wanted and then eventually my curveball started to get some speed too and I was able to throw that for strikes and strike batters out. Throwing hard and throwing strikes. That's that's pretty much the name of the game. It's the hardest we've seen this year. I know that, but um, can I put a mile an hour on it? No, I can't. It's not the start Brainerd wanted, but Lakeville North is one heck of a team. Hopefully the Warriors can pick themselves up for the consolation game tomorrow. From St. Paul, I'm Shane Lee, Lakeland News. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.